Okay, we're coming up on the test flight launch of the Atlas V rocket. Uh, the target altitude for this rocket will be 100 kilometers above the planet Kerbin today. Uh, again, this is a test flight. There is no payload uh, aboard this rocket. And um, as you can see, we are just waiting on the launch pad uh, for liftoff. And the autopilot is now engaged. And we will be launching in uh, T-10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. And the engines roar to life and we have liftoff on the test flight of the Atlas V rocket. And this rocket is being autonomously controlled by MechJab 2.0. 2.0.8 and again the target altitude is 100 kilometers uh, this rocket um, has I has been flown one, one other time and that was a also a successful test flight and again there was no payload on that rocket either and for power for this rocket we have uh, six solar panels on the second sta second stage and we will um, well, those will power the entire rocket. And we are coming up on 30 seconds into the flight and burnout of the SRBs as solid rocket boosters. And there's burnout and separation. We have a good clean separation on all four uh, SRBs on the Atlas V rocket. And we are just over 30 seconds into the flight. Uh, currently... Uh, the rocket's altitude is 3.7 kilometers and uh, ascending at 116 meters per second as expected. Uh, we are burning a normal amount of fuel as expected and the gravity turn uh, will begin at uh, 10 kilometers. Right now we are at 5 kilometers. If you take a look at the ascent path, uh, again the turn will start at 10 kilometers and the turn end will st uh, be at 70 kilometers. And this is uh, our projected ascent path right here. And we do not have a flight path angle, we're just going to go straight to 90 degrees and do an equatorial orbit. And we're coming up in one minute. One minute into the flight. Uh, the rocket is performing well. Uh, all systems, systems are normal uh, as expected. Uh, we are ascending at 162 meters per second and climbing. Uh, we're at just about 8 kilometers now. And the current apolapsis of this rocket is 10 kilometers. And that is also climbing. Uh, we're at 9.5 kilometers altitude and our gravity turn will begin shortly. And mark 10 kilometers, our gravity turn is now beginning. The rock will slowly turn to uh, gain centrifugal force to Kerbin so we can get in orbit. The rocket now going 255 meters per second and that is climbing. Uh, we're just above 50% fuel. Uh, as of this time, and uh, it is uh, feeding off the main tank, as you can see. The adapter tank is empty, and the current altitude of the rocket is 15 kilometers and climbing. Uh, it is, um, the rocket has just entered a slightly thinner part of the atmosphere. Uh, we're not quite in space yet, but uh, we are getting there slowly. We are coming up on two minutes into the flight, and uh, that will be in about 10 seconds. So far, um, everything is going normal, and we are having a good test flight of the Atlas V rocket. Coming up, coming up on two minutes. Mark two minutes into the flight, the rocket continues its gravity turn. And uh, we're, uh, we are running out of fuel as expected. Everything is going normally. The altitude of the rocket is uh, 26 kilometers and climbing at uh, 
1.7 kilometers per second and that is also rising and now the apoapsis of this rocket is 47 kilometers of climbing at this time the rocket has entered a more thinner part of the atmosphere as you can see the stars are starting to show up you can see the atmosphere now and um, we're just about halfway into space uh, we're almost out of fuel in the main tank uh, as expected uh, we are coming up on two and a half minutes in the flight mark two and a half minutes and we're about to have uh, engine cutoff and there's engine cutoff and we should have separation in a couple seconds and we have separation we have a good clean separation on the stage and we have good clean fairing separation if you take a look see we have the um, remote guide unit and the mech jeb unit and there's our maneuver node we have just under 2000 fuel in this tank and just under 2400 oxidizer in this tank as well uh, we are running on three engines for the second stage and these solar panels are now powering the rocket Uh, the rocket is now in space and we are now just time warping to the maneuver node and that will be our circularization burn and that will come up in a few seconds and we are burning All three engines are performing well on the Atlas V uh, second stage. We're coming to the, to the end of the burn. And mark the end of the burn at 5 minutes and 21 seconds. Uh, Atlas V is in orbit. Uh, this was another successful test flight of the Atlas V rocket. And it now sits safely in orbit around Kerbin.